guys, Penadaily here, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Detective Conan. In the last episode, we made it here to Narsh. I'm resaving. Yeah, I uh, basically logged in just long enough to check something. Uh, you know how I said we were going to go into Narsh today? We're not gonna do that. There's some stuff I really should have done. Yeah, yeah, I know. So, first and foremost, we're gonna head down to... Where's my party? Okay, it's Shiho and Yaiba, so we're good. We're going to head down to Zen. I was just checking to see who I had on the off chance I'd run into Doom Gaze. I'd rather not run into Doom Gaze, but it might happen. Alright. There we are. Anyway, as I said, we're going to Zen because I want to pick up some stuff, and then we're probably going to go to Kolingan. You got anything new to say? No. No, you don't. Yes, we've been there. Okay. Weapon shop. Uh, I want to get another fire knuckle for Heiji. Yes, I know he's not actually in our party right now, but trust me. There we go. Because he's got two poison claws and he's got two dragon claws, and having Heiji dual wield various claws can be very useful. Okay. Now we're going to go up to Kolingan. There we go. At this point, you might start to find yourself running out of money if you don't want... If you run out of things to sell, just, uh, there is a place, the desert near Miranda, where we went the first time. Bye. We are going to buy another trump. Trust me. Actually, uh, I'm gonna buy another enhancer. Wait, no, I don't have to. I can put, let's see, I can equip one on Shiho right now. The falchion is supposedly better. There we go. But, um, we're not really going to use them we're for weapons. You'll see. Alright, so that's what I wanted to do there. And now we're going to go... That's not what we wanted to do. That's what we wanted to do. We're going to go north a little more. Uh, and, remember, up here, near the mouth of this peninsula thing, inlet was the guy who wanted to build a Colosseum? Well, it looks like he's managed. Welcome to the Dragon's Neck Colosseum. The more precious the item wagered, the better your prize will be. Yes, yes it will. Yeah, champions from all over the world come here to fight for prizes. And yes, that is who you think it is. <laughs> Look at me, I'm a receptionist. <laughs> now you'd better watch your bet or Master Chupon will just come and take it from you. Actually, that's not true. What'll happen is if you bet a trash item, you will fight Chupon, and he will probably sneeze you out of the battle. Battles at the Colosseum are one-on-one. -on -one. Talk to this guy. I'm an Imperial Trooper, probably the last of them. I have some valuable information for you. Talk to the Emperor twice. Use this when you found the place where the Emperor hid the secret treasure. Well, remember we talked to a guy in Gidor? Oh, talk to this gentleman. Someone's in pretending to be me! Don't be fooled! Yeah, this is the actual character. I'm sort of surprised they named him Yamamura, too, given that... Well, Yamamura is a complete waste of space, and this guy is an actual badass, but... Okay, so we have an inn. We could stay here if we wanted, but we don't really need to. Ultros is your receptionist? He couldn't pay his debt, so I put him to work. I figure he'll be here about another hundred years. So yes, that is the final fate. Yep, creatures from all over the world come here to compete. That is the final fate of our squid. Get a load of the crowds. Yeah, okay. So, now I'm going to do some betting, because we kind of want things. Uh, it doesn't really matter who I put on, but uh, let's do some relic equipment. Um, equip. Actually, you know what? Uh, relic. We're gonna do Hakuba. 
And instead of his Dragoon boots, I'm going to give him a wall ring. There we go. And now I'm going to do a save state. Because, well, right before I talk to this gentleman. Because you and you will want to if you're doing it on an emulator you will want to save state otherwise you want to go outside and save before you bet every time because if you lose the battle you lose the item if you win the battle you also lose the item but you get a better one and you do not control your character here in the Colosseum they will use whatever attacks they have luckily you get healed to full MP and HP pretty much any time, so you should be fine, and they won't really, I don't think they can use items, but yeah, save. Care to fight in the Coliseum? With pleasure. Okay, now we can bet almost anything. Let's see, and that's, this is why I told you to keep a lot of stuff. Let's see. Okay, come on, come on. Come on, let's see. Here, the Tsarina gown. We want to bet this. And uh, who would I put the ring on? I put the ring on Hakuba. Now, the sky base is, see we have the wall ring on him? Just keep trying to run away. Because the sky base has some very nasty counters, but it also uses instant death spells. So if you're trying to run away, which you cannot do in the Colosseum, you will not. Okay, so now we have the Minerva, and I'm going to hit the save position again so we don't lose that. Because I do want to do some other um, stuff here. Specifically, let's see, we're going to, uh, we're going to go back out and get on, because I'm going to get Heiji. He's going to be our powerhouse. He, Heiji and Kid are actually going to be our powerhouses for the next few bits, so. All right, I don't want to de-equip anybody right now. So, talk to Heiji, right. Okay, sure. All right, um, I'm gonna leave you in and I think you actually, because I'm not gonna use the Ron or the Chibi or Yaiba for anything right now. Right now, really, Kid, Heiji, and Hakuba are your real choices for Colosseum stuff. And you can stay at the inn if necessary, as I said. Right. So, let's see. Now that I've got everybody, I'm just going to hit another save state. And you will do this a lot, because if you screw up, you just want to reload. All right, so uh, let's do some equipping. Heiji. Actually, first of all, Relic. Heiji. We're going to equip him with a Genji glove. And uh, let's see. What else can I do? What else do I want to do? Let's see. Gaia gear is for his weapon. Um... Or, actually, I think I have some... I have some cherub down! Ah, that's good. Okay, actually... Nah. Since I'm gonna put Gaia gear on him, never mind. Let's give him something else. What's good? Hmm. We'll give him an atlas arm. It, let, I really hope that... That music doesn't mean that I'm dropping frames or something. Okay. Double Dragon Claws, that's actually not what we want to do. We want to give him double Fire Knuckles. And we're going to give him the Gaia Gear instead of the Ninja Gear. Because, and I'm going to, yeah. Every time you change something, you might as, well, really stop that. There. All right, every time you change something, you might as well do this with pleasure. We are going to bet. Come on. Let's find them. A falchion. Really? I only have two? Somebody must have, somebody else must have one. Uh, whatever. I've got the wrong thing. <sighs> Hold on. 
Right, I could have sworn the falchion got uh, the opinicus, but uh, it doesn't. So I was doing this wrong. Okay, equip. Equip. Trump. Trump. Ugh, right, hold on. Relic. Heiji. We're gonna remove that Genji glove from him. I don't care right now. That's nice. Relic. Kid. Kid needs the Genji glove and the black belt. I did take it. It's not on Heiji, right? No, it's not on Heiji. Genji glove and the ba black belt. Optimum equipment changed. Good. Except we're going to equip him with the trump. Can I give him a better ha helmet? No. Crystal mail is the best we can give him. Okay. Sorry, I got my um, bets mixed up. So, file. Save game position. Let's do this again. Yes, I do want to. The way this works, this guy works, is that, let's say, right, so bet the falchion. The way this works is that Kid has, assuming this jerk's, uh, hmm. let's try this again. And if I, if at this point, if I don't get it, I'll probably quit. There we go. Sorry, it's the soul saber that, uh, you get a falchion. I'll, I'll deal with that. Good, good. What you're hoping for is that one of kids' attacks will get off instant death. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Yep. Okay. So, yeah, um, I'm just gonna keep doing this until I get one that I win. You have to do this a lot. Okay, so we got a flame shield. Uh, now I actually want to do that uh, at least one more time, but um, not just yet. Uh, let's see. Okay, we're gonna take the uh, Genji glove off of Kid for now and equip it to Heiji because we're gonna do the thing I thought I was doing. That Genji glove. Yes, yes, optimum equipment changed. Good. Equip fire knuckle. Fire knuckle. Okay, we're gonna do this again. Care to fight in the Coliseum? With pleasure, yes. Remember that soul saber we had? Yeah. It's really not that useful, but if we, it will get us another falchion. So, we're gonna try this. Riot, that hurts, but mantra, really? Slide, that's an earth attack. And should heal him since he's wearing Gaia gear. Nope, apparently not. Better reload. Well, that worked. I sort of forgot to put the Gaia gear on him. The slide should have healed him, but I kept messing up. Oops. So yeah, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll save. File. Yeah, just save. So yeah, I mean, if you check our inventory, you can see that we don't have the Soul Saber anymore, but we still have two falchions. Right, but we have two falchions, because that's what we won from that Opinicus. So, let's see, what else? Anything else I want to show off? 
Yes, actually. Um, we do need... Uh, and when Heiji goes into his next battle, he will be healed. So, let's see. Who else do I want? I want to go up against a Cactrot. And for that, we're going to equip Kid. Um, equip. Let's see. We actually want to equip his dice. They're not nearly as good, but they ignore, like, defense and stuff. So, that should be fine. That Everything else, that's pretty good. So, again, save. Care to fight in the Coliseum? With pleasure. Okay, we want to bet an elixir. Come on. There. And kid. So, we get a, we'll get a rename card. We're not actually going to do anything with this now, because the next battle you fight with it is kind of... Ow. Osmos? You picked Osmos? Yeah. You know the drill. And there we go. The dice do damage based on what they've got on their uh, thing. Okay, so uh, now I want to get two more falchions to get, um, basically, I bet two more falchions to get two more um, flame shields, and that's going to take a little while. So I will be back once I'm done with that. See you then. Okay, so uh, let's um, just check our items. <clears throat> As you can see, we're also out of falchions. Let's uh, arrange, use, just to look at things. Okay, so let's see. We have flame shields. Those absorb fire elemental attack. They're pretty nice. I wanna go down to the armor. We also have the Minerva. It raises MP by one qu by one quarter, which is nice. You take 50% damage from several elements, and you take no damage from several others, but it can only be used by adult women, so I can't use it. But yeah, it's, it's good against fire and ice and uh, lightning, and it's proof against wind, fire, light, <laughs> lice. Wind, fire, lightning, and ice. It's armor, it's probably fairly good against lice. So that, I wanted to do all of that basically to prepare. And now I'm going to stay at the inn because your wounds do carry over. Yeah, sure. Your wounds do carry over. If you find yourself running low on um, gold, you can go fight cactrots in the desert outside Miranda. But, and we might do that but not yet. Or you can go to the Veld and grind, which I probably will do. Okay. So, we're going to go get on... I'm going to... Let's get back on the airship, because we're now we're finally going to go to Narsh. But first... I'm going to talk to the Chibi. Yes, yes, I know. It was a good movie, too. It... If you liked Die Hard, you would probably like Movie 14. Chibi. There are lots of... We will be back at the Coliseum later. But there are a lot of really nasty things we just can't do there right now. Okay. Talk to the old man, because I want to de-equip those not now in my party. Good. Now we're going to equip... The chibi. Equip. Let's give him a flame shield. Good. Equip Yaiba. We'll give him a flame shield. Good. Equip Hakuba. We're gonna give him a flame shield. 
And Shiho is going to get, of course, equip a... No. She's going to get the Minerva for now. Okay. Uh, quick check. I just want to make sure I know that I'm right about who has what. Okay, let's see. Shiho has Berserk. Excellent. Uh, wait. Let's see. What are you working on? Shout. Uh, let's see. You're not working on anything right now. Uh, we're gonna give you Phantom. Yes, I know he's learned all of it, but we want it for the battle. Let's see. Chibi? Uh, we'll give you something, though. I don't think any of it will be particularly... Party members use a jump attack. Uh, that actually might be useful. Uh, just teach the chibi that. Uh, let's see. And uh, equip, uh, what are you? Er, not equip, skills. What? Esper. You, Gollum. I, I don't think we need that for this fight, but I'll leave it on you for now. All right. Now we're going back to Narsh. Lift off. I want Shiho to learn Doom, dang it. Although, really, she doesn't need to. Um, with uh, Yaiba in the party, but uh, you never know. Okay, let's see. Uh, this music's really pretty, but it will get really repetitive really fast if you're not careful. Ah, there we go. Should be right around here somewhere. Come at it from this direction, and maybe I can see it. Ah, here we are. Ugh. Okay, now we're going into Narsh. Thank you, Fight, for reminding me I need to screw with people's relics. She's fine. Hakuba, though, I'm gonna take off... I'm gonna put that amulet back on him. We probably don't need it, but I'm still going to. You get a hero ring. The chibi! We, if we put the Moogle charm on him, there would be no random encounters. I don't feel like doing that right now. We'd like to sort of grind a bit. The chibi is the other person who does really, really well with dragoon boots. His dances are no longer that great. Eh? What are you doing here? Doesn't matter, really. Nothing left anyway. There's only one chibi still around, and only a treasure hunter could pick that lock. Oh ho! Yeah, most of this place is locked up. We want to head to the old man's house. Oh, nasty Adon. Uh, Marshall's fine. I think they're weak to water, honestly, but I don't care. There we go. The amazing jumping Chibi and Hakuba! Alright, soon enough they'll come down. Yep. Did we mention that they do a lot of damage? Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty nice. That's very nice, actually. So we want to get to Andre's house. Which should be up this way, if I remember. Jump is actually really nice because it, as you can see, just thought I'd check and see if he restocked. Okay. Actually, this isn't where we want to go. I'm an idiot. This is how you would come out if, like, you had decided not to warp back with the chibi. What we want to do is actually go right up... Actually, I'm leaving this in because I want to show you guys what Shiho's bio does to this guy. I mean, the chibi, the jump is nice because it gets the chibi and Hakuba out of the way of any attacks this guy might make. Might want to heal Yaiba. So, yeah, it, it, you gotta admit, Bio does some damage. Alright. Not enough to kill him, but usually enough to hurt. Uh, yeah, wait. Uh, let's heal Yaiba. Hakuba, we're not- you're not gonna be using too much of that. Uh, here too. 
There we go. I don't think anybody else is... Yeah, nobody else is badly enough hurt to care. For now. Right. Oh, hey, the chibi learned slow. So that's nice. Yeah, most of these buildings are locked. Right. Okay. So, basically, we're going to come up this way. Through here. God bless flame shields. They uh, will absorb HP if somebody casts fire on you, like, say, Magroders. Got some throwing weapons for a certain person who will eventually show up. Let's see. Okay, keep going on. Yeah, we're basically... The only problem with Dragoons is they really do stay in the air a long time, so they don't always get their attacks in. But that's okay! So, hey look... Actually, leaving this in. Okay, so we got Red Wolf uh, and Psychot. Uh, jump. Magic. Let's see. Ice. Actually, um, no, uh, just fight. Jump. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna need to heal Yaiba, but there should, but that save point, remember that save point back from when we fought the thing, battle with Kefka? Uh, or uh, Sangria up here? Yeah, that should still be here, which is good. Also, the reason I'm leaving this in, Hakuba gained a level. And the Chibi mastered the last of his dances, Snowman Jazz, which I'm going to show off just because. Okay. Dance! It's really not that useful at this point because dances generally aren't, but... Ice. Single target ice should be okay. Oh dear. Well, that's going to be a thing. But yeah, so Snowman da Jazz can do some nasty, nasty things. So it's kind of nice. Yep, okay, kill the wizards. We hope, anyway. Yep, surge. Yeah, that's the same attack. It's a nice attack. Yeah, that, that was pretty nice, wasn't it? I think, let's see. Oh, great. Can I get past you? Um, let's see if I can. Uh, that is the ice... Okay, new uh, snowman jazz attack. Snowball didn't do much, but still. Might want to heal. Yaiba. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. Oh crud. Well, fine. Good, the chibi just attacks again with surge, so I'm just leaving this in. Gotta love that. muddle on the chibi. And the chibi's confused. I don't think it matters much. Since he's already... Ooh, ow it does. He snowballed himself. That hurt. Chibi, don't you have flame shield? Well, whatever. Yeah, we all, I guess Snowball doesn't actually do ice damage, because as you see, none of us took damage from the ice attack, because we all have flame shields, except for Shiho, who's got the Minerva. Okay, so what I am going to do is I'm going to use a tent, and, th and then I'm going to save and call it for now, and next time we're going to go take on 
you know what? This episode was all the Colosseum. I'm not going to be that awful. All right. I am still going to save, though. <laughs> all right. So, save. Yes. All right, so now we're gonna go take on that dragon. Quick check to make sure everybody is equipped appropriately. She's got the Minerva. He's got a flame shield. He's got a flame shield. He's got a flame shield. Uh, she's got, okay, she, she has Berserk and Hakuba has Phantom. We're gonna cheese this guy. We're gonna cheese this guy hard. This is one of those eight legendary dragons they told us about. So, uh, yeah, all right, um, ugh, rage, uh, let's see. Oh, great, oh, great, um, Templar. Chibi, use, um, well, Chibi is gonna use, uh, fire on, uh, Shiho, first of all. And then, um, I thought, right, I thought I, whatever. Chibi doesn't even have fire, great. Ugh. Well, this is gonna be a thing. Okay, um, wow. Uh, jump. <laughs> well, hopefully that frozen status will wear off. Because otherwise this is gonna be silly. Um, yeah. Just, uh, yeah, magic. Oh. Ah. Uh, what, what works really well to cheese this guy, if you can do it, is to, um... Yeah. What works really well to cheese this guy, if you can do it, is to cast Berserk on him and then use uh, Phantom to, be, to make yourself immune to his physical attacks. But of course... Yeah, you'd best be frozen. Oh great, now the Chibi's frozen. Well, we're gonna have fun. Hopefully it will... Hopefully it'll wear off, because otherwise, this is going to be stupid. <laughs> uh. Oh, good. <laughs> All right, so now he's berserked. And, of course, Hakuba's going to cast fire on Shiho, which is actually going to heal her. Good. All right. Um, let's see. Uh, Shiho cast. Uh, Shiho cast fire on the chibi. Hakuba is going to use. Uh, what? Who? Crud. I thought I had fan. Who has phantom? Probably the chibi. Well, I'm screwed. Well, I'm not screwed. It's just. Um, do you have? Out of curiosity, dude, do you have Vanish? You do not. Alright, just, uh... Magic. Cast Fire 2 on him. <laughs> Magic. Do you have Vanish? Yes, you do. Vanish. Can I? No, I can't. So I'm just gonna put it on you first. Good. Jump. Oh, this is, this is silly, but it worked. I could have sworn I had, well, whatever. Just jump. We're still doing a nice amount of damage. No, he's got Palador. Who'd I put, hey, I bet I put it on Yaiba. Whatever. <laughs> we beat him. <sighs> oh, even when I prepare, I screw up. I hope you guys are enjoying this.
Conan learned float and fire too. And we got a force shield. That's nice. Seven dragons left. We're going back here. We're going to save. <laughs> uh, let's see. Everybody could really use some healing. Um, let's see. Skills. Yeah, Yaiba had phantom, which was exactly the wrong thing to do. Oops. <sighs> Sometimes I just am stupid. Sorry, guys. <laughs> All right. So we're going to... I'm going to use another tent and then and uh, save. So... But we still beat it. Which, you know, is not the worst thing. So it's not like the, the worst thing we could have done. We'll do better on the next fight. Alright. So, saving. So, in, in the next episode, we will continue on with the mountains. And we've got some interesting stuff to do. So, join me next time. Thank you for being here for Detective Conan. Final, my Final Fantasy Detective Conan, and you have a great evening. Goodbye.